But for real, bro, if you don't have any haters in your life, you're doing something wrong. You know what I'm saying? Especially with me rapping and singing and shit. Like, I don't like the word rapper because it gives people bad vibes. But if you rapping and singing, it comes with the territory. If you have no haters in your life, you're doing something wrong. You really are. But with Instagrams, Twitter, any type of social media platform, bro, they don't want you to win. So it's like with me rapping and singing, trying to push it and network and shit, they're not going to share my music. It's, 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 it, unless it's money. Because nowadays everything is about money, 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 money. Money, money, money. You know what I'm saying? Everybody's in that fast lane and wanting to get rich quick get rich quick schemes and shit, bro. It's not about that no more, bro. It's about what you want to do and how you want to do it. Like I said, if you don't got haters in your life, you're doing something wrong. Because the haters are going to be the ones to share you. The haters are going to be the one. Look at, check this nigga out. This nigga trash. But if you go back and rewind and go back to 22 years, Cloudy Days, Volume 1, what is it? No religion, Jim and now cold hearted stories. You know, everything that I drop, I put my heart and my soul in it, and everybody just hates on it, bro. You know what I'm saying? I don't really have a structured fan base, but yet I still keep going. I mean, this is it's, it comes with the territory, bro. I'm the best kept secret, and that's just something that I've learned to accept. Is that that's why I got that tape coming out, best kept secret, and they they not even gonna know because it's gonna hit them by such a surprise surprise and it's, it's gonna hurt them it's gonna hurt them because this is like this nigga too cold and one day god is gonna be like the universe is gonna be like this nigga we need to give him an opportunity they ain't gonna pass me up one of these days bro it's gonna be i'm gonna go viral like nas x yes indeed and and everybody's gonna know like damn this nigga everything he drops is is fantastic I tell you, a lot of people don't want to listen to the truth because they've been lied to all their life. So it's just like, why would you listen to the truth? I don't expect you to listen to the truth. But what I expect you to listen to is the fact behind the truth. That I'm the best kept secret. That ain't no lie. The world don't know me now. But they will. In the year 2021, I'm predicting this right now. I'm going to be in the public eye. And everybody going to be like... I'm going to be like, but they don't appreciate you until you're dead, bro. They don't appreciate you until you're dead. When you're dead, a whole world knows you. The same thing with Nipsey Hussle. The same thing with X. I can't say so much about X because I only listened to one song of his before he passed away. When he passed away, that's when I started to get into his music. And yeah, do I believe he's dead? No. Nipsey Hussle. I heard Racks in the Middle with him and Roddy Rich because I was a fan of Roddy Rich before he even started becoming bigger. So I heard if he hustles some music before he passed away. But they don't love you until you're dead. It's a fact. And people die every day from depression. People die every day. And some of these artists ain't doing it like me, bro. I produce all my songs. I make all of my, most of my beats I make myself unless I buy them. And I make my cover arts. I promote myself. I'm doing what most of these rappers can't do. I'm learning. I'm learning as I grow. Like I said, 2021 may not be this year, but 2021, for sure, I'm going to be a millionaire. No world going to be like, damn. Damn. They ain't going to promote me now, but they will promote me in the year 2021. I'm telling you right now. And I keep saying this shit because I'm going to be in a G-Wagon, Mercedes Benz with a two-car garage with a fucking Prius and shit, man. I'm trying to tell you, bro. They don't, they don't love you until you're dead, man. They don't, they, they don't. They don't appreciate anything that I drop. They don't share it. You know what I'm saying? You got all these people and all these resources, man, and all these people just don't appreciate you until you're dead, bro. You know what I'm saying? My family don't even share my music, and my mom has the most connections, and she don't even share my fucking music. She don't share my music. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, I'm the one doing all the work. I'm building this shit by my bare fucking hands, bro. It's frustrating sometimes, but I still do it, man. Still do it. It's life, man. That's what, that's what life is. That's what life is about, man. Doing what you want to do and how you want to do it and how you want to pursue it. So if you want to do music, do it. If you want to drive, do it. That's why Nike made that just do it stuff, bro. 
telling you, man, you just you just got to go after it, man. Work hard at it. Grind at it. You know what I'm saying? You got to be like Tony Hawk. You got to grind on these rails, man. You got to grind. You got to keep going. Then when the whole world see you, they see you shining, motherfuckers going to try to pull a drink and steal your flow. Just try to steal your light. And it's trying to steal your dim, but you got to switch the shit again. Facts. Facts, bro. I'm too realistic, you know what I'm saying? So if I ever, you know, come to a conclusion, it's because these are people out here. There's people out here that will try to silence you from knowing the shit. That's why I keep my peace. I don't say too much. There's a whole lot of shit that I can say, but a whole lot of shit I won't say. Because I can put myself in danger for most of the shit. Facts. Facts. I think that the, if, if Nipsey Hussle was dead, if Juice World was dead, if, if X was dead, Mac Miller, it's because the government killed him. Because they, they, those were celebrities that was trying to tell you the truth. Being famous is not diff, is not easy. It's not easy. I was a fan of Amy Whitehouse. So being a celebrity is not easy. I'm technically a celebrity now, but low key. I can walk in my neighborhood now. Nobody would know my name. That's why I wrote the song, Nobody. So, it's a fact, bro. It's a fact.